What's up, everybody? Hi. Um, we're here. <gasps> the, uh, the live stream looks weird, but we're here. Oh, I know why it looks weird. Save and continue. Do you have to change your uh, video settings? Uh, I do have to change my video settings, Ian. <clears throat> but we're here, back for Subpixel Inc. I guess part two. Um, we're not really part, labeling these part, since uh, part two. Uh, since they are uh, live streamed. Mm -hmm. But we're still here anyways. Yes. So to pick it up from last time, um, we decided that Will was going to build the rocket and I was going to build the uh, car for gamers representation in Kerbal. We were going to marry them together and try and get them to the moon. Um, and I decided I think we can also get that Last car time. for gamers back from the moon. Oh, dear Lord. I just heard an echo. Uh, I was checking to make sure we were fine for a second. Okay, we are fine. Um, <laughs> okay, so um, how do you think? Maybe we show off the rocket and then we show off the rover and then we marry them. I think so. The rocket... Okay, so I um, oh shoot, I forgot. I, oh, hello, brother. Um, <clears throat> so Hi, brother. I um, I work a lot of hours during the week, and I don't have a ton of time because I'm a stupid person who plays a lot of Destiny. Um, mm -hmm. so I um, do I just need to restart this? What's what's wrong? I don't know. You see on the stream, there's that gap on the side. Oh, I'm not watching the stream. Let me look at it. <clears throat> Let me check my. I setup. don't watch our content. That's true. Oh, oh, I do. Wow. Is it is it in OBS that you don't have the video centered? No, it, it should. Be. Let me just restart it. Like, what does it look like in OBS? It looks like that in OBS. Well, then that's probably the issue. Like, you know how when you in OBS, you can move the image around? Yeah, but it wasn't letting me. Huh. Oh, it's still to the side. Oh, I fixed it. I literally did what Ian told me to do. Yep. Thanks, Ian. Hey, no problem. Okay. okay. So um, all good. Okay. So it should be fixed by now. Anyways, um, <clears throat> so I haven't had a ton of time to put into this rocket, but I um I did play like all the scenarios and stuff, so I know how to get there. Mm -hmm. So this is uh this should go better than last time. Okay, Let so me show me your rocket, here. and then I'll show you mine. Um. Oh, that's a good burp. Oh, hey, give me uh, two seconds. My 3D print just finished. I got to turn my printer off. Yeah, go for it. <coughs> okay, we should be up and running. The stream should look good now. At this point, me talking. <coughs> I'm sorry if I'm coughing. I just wolfed down an entire platter of chicken shawarma. Uh, from Midtown, it is the most delicious food I've ever eaten in my life. I think it's my new favorite food. <clears throat> it is so good. I I can't even. Uh, it's just so good. Uh, I am drinking uh, some vodka and Red Bull. Uh, it's Thursday. Red Dead Redemption 2 comes out at midnight. I don't have work tomorrow. So, you know, I'm kind of just ready to go. <clears throat> Um, Ian, uh, what 3D printer you have? Uh, I'll ask him when he gets back. I'm about to get a 3D printer from my buddy at work, selling me his somewhat broken one for 50 bones. I'm kind of excited about that. Will, are you um, talking to yourself again? Yes, I'm talking to myself. <laughs> okay, great. Um, <laughs> this rocket I named, <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> so, Zach, I have, a, I have an Ender 3. I bought it a couple weeks ago. It's pretty great. I... I, I would recommend it if you think you're going to play around with it enough. Okay, so show me this rocket. Um, so I'll show you all the iteration. This is the one I've landed on. I th you, I'm sorry, you what? I've landed on. Oh, I thought you said you blanded on. No, landed on. <clears throat> I've gotten to the moon. Or, or I've gotten. I've had some successful takeoffs with it. I'll say that much. Um, you know, worst comes to worst, Ian, we just design one together. But, yeah, uh, I think, I I think that's doable. I got an upper okay. stage, lower stage. So uh, let me show you. This is the other one I was working on for a while. Where is it? 
Is it that weird looking one that was rover plus stock down? Sky Crane? No. Is that it? Oh, no, 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 no. Are you sure? I named them funny things. I don't know where. Oh, you know what? It's in my other save. Isn't that kind of lame, though, that, that crafts are. Like, I don't know if there's an easy way for you to pull over other than having to go to File Explorer and move them over between. You have to go to File saves. Explorer. So, is, I think this is the new one you made? No, mine's Mark II. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's already a sub assembly. That's great. Yes, that's correct. Okay, so <clears throat> my grand plan. Boop. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Is to do one of those on it? On the, fr on the, oh my god, on the top? Yeah, boy. You can't, I think you have to do it on the top. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, because it does that little, unless you can push that last thing to a different spot. Anyways, let me grab. Okay, but but before you before you attach the rover, we need to open it on its own so I can show you the mechanisms. And I think this is the wrong one. That is. Oh, that did kind of look like the wrong one. Uh, yeah, so let's switch to the space plane hanger. Space plane hanger. <clears throat> you know we're very. Uh, sorry, I've got a tickle in my throatal. I done been tickled. Oh, you know what I have to do? I have did to you open did it. you not save it in the right one? No, I saved it in the v in this one, but yeah. you can fix that by just switching. That's that's my baby. Okay, now let's launch it. Oh my and goodness. I'll walk you through. Ian. <clears throat> okay, all right. The very first thing you have to do, and I didn't do this when you told me we we're going to launch it on the outside, I, I disabled it. You need to extend that solar panel on the top immediately. Immediately. Now tell me that doesn't look like our beautiful spoiler. It really does. <laughs> I know, right? Except, well, except for when it does that. <laughs> <laughs> I love that the sun is below us, so it's trying to face it. Um, okay, so so basically what I did was... So, so that is the stage to separate us. That is the stage to um, retrofire to fire retrograde around moon orbit so that we can slow down enough to land on the moon. Okay. Okay, now press G. So once we want to get off the moon, we need to get up to a 45 degree angle. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> yes, okay. And then, okay, hit R and T. Okay, and now, um, okay, now hit, hit, hit space bar again. I think it's I think it's stage one, but basically there's a solid fuel rocket <laughs> to launch us from the moon. And then at the same time it's supposed to get rid of the landing gear. And then we should have enough monopropellant to get back to Earth and land safely and use the parachutes. I don't No. Yes, That's okay. That's never gonna happen. Okay, but here's what I, I thought that too. I actually spent probably like ten hours working on it through various iterations. And I I used cheats to spawn me in moon orbit and land, and that worked. And I also used cheats and then and then I got off the moon back into to Earth orbit. And then I also used cheats to get from Earth orbit back to the Earth to land safely. So I think it will work. Yeah, so you should be able to attach that to the top of the rocket. Okay. So let's, Hey, uh... mom's here. Hi, mom. Hey, mom's here. How's it going, mom? Good old Colton. <clears throat> so let's go to my rocket. So I, you know what? I have a good feeling, Ian. I have a pretty good feeling too, because we can always cheat. Oh, so this that's is very fancy looking. This older one I built. Wow, that looks so cool. Um, so these do not work. Uh, I'm just gonna get Wait, why don't? Oh, because they're not attached, or are they just boosters? no? They're just not strong enough. Oh, okay. So I'm thinking if I attach boosters. The solid fuel boosters to the sides. Yeah, so I gotta open that. Oh. Take this old one out. 
Oh, whoops. Uh, oh, no, I think I, yeah, I know exactly what the issue is. It's because there's no way you're going to be able to lift that weight just with boosters. I think you need to do liquid fuel on the bottom, then the payload, and then boosters around the outside. So this, yeah, this is like, that, those were liquid on the side, but that, oh, that engine well, just wasn't good enough. What? Yeah. Yeah, I can see that. Okay, that goes there. Is that fitting? It should fit with a four size yeah. bay. It looks like it fits. Oh my god, this looks really good, Will. So this <laughs> this is my other rocket. Okay. So let's just okay. see. <laughs> You're so excited. Yeah. Um what if we do two stages of boosters? Wait. Is that stupid? Why is what? You got a you got a middle mouse click. You're also in the wrong bay. Oh, Oh, you probably got to drop your, uh, yeah. Yep. Um, what if we do two sets of boosters? Like a first and second stage of solid rocket boosters? Or do you think that's weird? Or just do that? But I think, I still think a first and second stage is good. Yeah. Oh, you got to switch your, um. Oops. Yeah, you got to make more of them. You got to switch to the eight. No, right? uh. Oh, yeah, I guess I could do that. I was yeah, going to, uh, but they're not going to align properly. That's what I'm, uh, because oh, I didn't place not? those things as eight. Oh. But this way they'll be separated. Oh, and then you'll get twice the duration. Okay, we got to test this immediately. Let's take a look at you. Oh, this, this is the one thing about Kerbal that annoys the me. The one thing? is placing things. I forgot how old this game is, and it's very easy to forget that considering like how good it bad. is. No, like how bad the, the user experience still is. Um, Colton says he burned his thumb when his wood stove. I think we need to name all of our Kerbals after him oh, so that buddy. he can share their suffering. Four boosters. Yes. Then we want to detach those, which is... So it loves to put all your stuff first. First? <clears throat> oh, because I was put last. Yeah, I noticed this when I was doing all my testing stuff. Like, all this is your rocket. Like, oh. None of it makes sense. That's going to get... Well, we don't need to worry about ordering that properly now. We just need to put your stuff towards the front. Yeah. Oh, that's internal. Those are all you. That's you. I think, I think, I think that's it, right? That's me. That's you. That's me. So that's you. Yeah, I think we're all good. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's do an old little save there. Yeah, let's overwrite that bitch. Okay. Okay. Uh, so, so Colton, our goal this time is I built a rover. We'll build a rocket. We're going to marry them together and see if we can get all the... The ultimate goal is to get that rover all the way to the moon, land it, drive it, and then fly it back to, to Earth slash Kerbin. <laughs> that took you a while. I know. This episode, we're going to see how far we get before we just uh, quit out of frustration. Okay. You ready for this? Yeah, absolutely. I can already hear the SAS firing. <laughs> what? <laughs> they just slid off. I know. Oh, this is way, this is bad. This is way too slow. Oh, it's so slow. Yeah. Oh, there she blows. Oh, that was me doing that. Oh, okay. I was trying to turn it to get into orbit way too early for you to turn. <laughs> they say to start turning at 50 meters per second. Oh, I thought it was like 7,000 meters. No, I do the meters per second stuff instead of the... Uh... Oh, okay. Oh, boy. This is... Yep. Yep. <clears throat> My rover's intact, isn't it? 
Yeah, fire it all off. Don't worry. I opened it. Oh no, the front part of it's gone. I still have rockets, yeah. Oh, I have no control. Oh, because you lost the control module. Okay. Cool, guys. So... Don't look at the explosions. Okay, so let me just... Oh, I think I know what happened. Look, look at your first stage. Your first stage, it has the detach in it. Your first stage is to fire four rockets. Oh, yeah. Detach. I'm an idiot. Yeah. Well, you gotta you gotta go to your second stage and move those rockets down too. I'm not gonna do that. I don't want them all firing at once. Oh boy, I don't know. You're gonna get enough thrust with that. Oh my. I would just make sure those um, the four line up with the four that you're firing in the first stage, as in the four I mean, that they're detached. all. They're all. I put them all in there. Oh okay. Okay. So let's see if that does anything. Oh, yeah. the other thing I'm gonna do. Literally all my knowledge of this game went out the window. How long has it been since you played? Uh, probably... I bought this game... So I was in the window to still get free updates for this game. Mm -hmm. um, so I bought this... I think I looked up. It's like April 2013. Or I bought it in March 2013. Or 20... Yeah. Whatever. That sounds about right for me, too. Because it was when I was unemployed post-college, which was 2013. So, yeah, that's when I played a lot. Uh, yeah. And it has... That was five years ago. Okay, let's let's do this. it. Feeling good. Uh, my mom sent me some Halloween decorations. I was very excited. I have two pumpkins. Little, like, fake pumpkins and some spiders. And I scared myself with one of the spiders already. <laughs> um, I forgot okay. I was going to post on Facebook that I was... How do I go up again? Oh, I hit the wrong button. But that's oh, good. that looks good, though. Oh, you did not. Yeah. Let's just restart the launch. <laughs> but <laughs> nothing you, happened. You... Man, that was a weird glitch on the stream. Yeah. It looks pretty good, though. It really does. Okay. Are you going to go full throttle on your liquid? So many rockets. No, okay. Because I don't want to lose too much of it. I think that's my only engine right now. Oh yeah, it is. Okay. You're looking pretty good. Oh. Oh. No, oh, just did a quick backflip. Do you not have like reaction wheels? I don't think I do. Oh yeah, I would add that. I think you. I think you definitely have enough. Let's go to the map real quick and see what your uh, map maps is. Eight uh, thousand. Well, it might have been the flips. That this is up. the one I put up earlier today. This guy. Oh, that's pretty good. From the same rocket, or? No, different rocket. Okay, so you're gonna save fuel. And then use that engine to get us to moon orbit. Yeah, basically. That's a pretty looking rocket, though. It's not bad. Um, hey, Will, what you doing? Do you like my little heat shield on the back? I do. I, I, I kept trying to re-enter Earth's atmosphere, and it was just exploding everything. So I actually have to go um, ass first, and it works. Let's see if this oh, works. Yeah. Um, you're going to have to deploy my parachutes manually, though. That's the only thing. you got to turn that pressure up, boy. Oh, what does the pressure do? It's so they have enough time. Oh, okay. And then it should land flat. Okay, they're ready to deploy. Oh, I see. Last time I played, I don't think you could do that with parachutes. Like, set them to auto-deploy. 
So yeah, it recognizes the air pressure. Oh, and then deploys it. Ooh. Goodbye. No. Uh, the other thing you should do is you should change your controls so that you control the wheels with I, J, K, L. Because the issue I have is um, if you try and control the wheels with Wasid, then you're like your reaction wheels are actively flipping the vehicle while you're trying to drive forward. Uh, Does that make sense? That's interesting. Yeah, so you kind of have to basically deliberately bind the wheels to different than the rotation. This I think dope. this may work. This may work. We just have to like nail everything right. Okay. Let's, uh... So I think for the rocket, all you have to do is get get either point us at the moon so we land on the moon or get us into moon orbit where's because uh... i think from there my sh the rover can handle it oh no <whistles> oh boy this is gonna be something isn't it Oh my god. Will, what are you doing? My job, Ian. Yeah. It looks like a freaking <laughs> rocket propelled grenade. No, it looks like a looks like <laughs> an adult toy. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. Oh my god, this is not gonna work. <laughs> <clears throat> of course oh it's God. gonna work. Oh, I haven't been reading chat. Oh, there's not. I'm, I've been oh, reading. There's it. nothing. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, it set off your stupid thing. Oh. Oh, I hate your. So it worked. It did work. Yeah, it puts all your stuff first. I don't understand it. Where is? Okay, that's. Why are you dragging them individually? Because I'm... Oh, you're yeah, right. Yeah, they're probably still grouped together properly. You just gotta drag the groups. Although it's kind of weird. I think it messed up some of the ordering that I had in my file. Yeah. This is... I'm gonna be very surprised. Wait, why did... What? Why did... Why don't you just go to the space plane hangar and fix it fully? The no. staging. I hate it. Okay, okay drag drag the entire engine. group. Isn't three yours? Uh, no, that's you. I mean five. Oh. It's five now. That's five you, right? is... No, that's you. That's me. That's Whoa. me. That's How did? You. Why did it do that? Why would it, like, mix up the the staging from a sub assembly? No idea, boy. You know, you think they would have fixed this by now? Wait, isn't this the the studio that like stopped paying their employees for a while? Yeah, and then, and they, then they were they got bought by uh, Take Two, and now supposedly yeah. everything's kosher. Where is my engine? That's There's me. one. That's just going to open everything. So that's me. That's yeah. me. But should then work. It, no, it go up to... Um, I think you're missing another engine, aren't you? No, I have keep the going. three and the one. Well, no, but keep going up. I thought I saw... Oh, yeah, that's one. me, but I'm just going to do that later. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, so this theoretically... <laughs> Oh, it's not bad for speed. It's too slow, but it, it's actually stable. Told you. This is... SpaceX butt plug, my brother This said. is ridiculous. But it works, Ian. It's the point. 
Oh my goodness. It literally will not let me turn. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of good in a way though it's so hard to turn I think you get stages yeah there you go oh that's not a good sign <laughs> fucking <laughs> look at this we made it oh, that's orbit that. right is that orbit it's so good. It should be easier to turn now. That is way too short for orbit. Here, I gotta pause this for a second. Change this order. What What if you just get rid of the solid rocket boosters and turn them into liquid fuel with liquid fuel tanks and we do asparagus staging? Um, I think that might work. I just want to see how far I can go with this thing. This is this is pretty awesome. When's the? Uh, I gotta see if the next stage is actually gonna properly fire. I think that's it there. Where's my rocket? No, that's the wrong rocket. Oh, uh, that's mine. Where's mine? Oh, there it is. Oh, no. That's not that bad, to be honest. Yeah. It's not bad for a first attempt. Oh, I'm... I'm Ooh. Look at this. You got a lot of fuel. I feel like that stage right there would probably get us to the moon. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, but I'm just going down. Yeah, that first stage just has to get me higher. Yeah. And then we can rely... Maybe we can rely on this stage to get us to... Uh, moon orbit? What do you think? It's got a lot of fuel, but it doesn't have a lot of push. Yeah. Oh. That was my landing gear. Yeah, deploy the payload. I want to see what it looks like. I can't. I have no more control. Uh, what if you right-click the payload part? I am. I mean, in the, <laughs> uh, in the stage. Oh. Nothing. Oh. All right, let's go. Okay. Let, yeah, let's try liquid fuel with asparagus. <laughs> Colton, I, I know. I feel like every successful test has to end with explosions. Okay, so liquid instead of that? Yeah, so just ah, add... Snake, you didn't know it was me. Uh -huh. I Sorry. would <laughs> maybe add a duplicate of what you've got there. Liquid of what I have here. Yeah, so you have a liquid fuel tank with a liquid rocket in the center. So just do a, a duplicate of that around it. Oh, gotcha. Although now that I think about it, I, that I don't think the engine you have on there is strong enough. What, this puppy? Yeah, I feel like you should up that entire assembly to the next size up. Really? Yeah. Let me put that there. I, I yeah. like this where it is. Yeah, I think that works. Uh, for but we gotta get that there. into orbit. So that I will keep the same. So I'm gonna do. First, we need a little structural. Yes. This is so hideous. It's beautiful. Um. Okay. So we have that. So let's do some uh, fuel tanks. Oh my uh, god, why do you keep switching off? Because uh, I am. I had to switch back. I was going to post it on Facebook, and then I haven't yet. And then I was trying to switch back to a thing. I forgot you can see that, but no one else can see that. Oh. Uh, 
Do you want to just take a, a short Facebook break? Uh, yeah, let me just post it on Facebook. Um, I'm gonna tell my 3D printing story because Will's busy. I um, I was putting on my dress shoes for work this morning, and I was using a shoehorn to put my feet in my shoes because they're tight shoes, and I broke my uh, shoehorn, and I was like, "Damn it! Where am I gonna find a shoehorn?" That's not like 10 bucks just buying it by itself. And then I forgot I have a 3D printer now, so I printed a shoehorn tonight. Um, and it looks like it's actually gonna work. You're the worst human being. That's my shoehorn story. Are you back? I can't believe you had a sh you have a shoehorn? Dude, I have blue suede shoes and they do not, they're not like leather where they like get softer over time. They're just solid. So I literally have to use a shoehorn to get my feet into them. Whoa. Yeah, see, let's get to that size. I think we're uh, good to go. We may not even need exterior rockets if we just blast off with that goober. That's bigger. Why don't you sort this, by this, uh, this size? Not... Just do a sort by size. How do you do that? Oh. Yeah. That's the biggest oh. one. Maybe that is the biggest one. Let's do it. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, the staging. And... Yeah, let's fix all this. Yeah, let's do it now. Okay. Yes. Let's zoom out. I'm going to look up real quick if you can do, like, sub... I'm going to put all your stages. Staging. Why? See, like, why is that? Anything that has to do with you, I'm putting up here. Wow, thanks. That's not okay, good. if this doesn't work, then we're gonna do asparagus staging. I agree. Rayquaza. That's, um, isn't that a Pokemon? Is it? I saw Moltan, is that his name? The new Pokemon, you seen that guy? think so molten meltan he's just like a pile of silver goo with a nut for a head what is this terminator <laughs> he, he looked real weird but then they revealed that he has an ultra or like an ultra evolution or whatever Oh, the mega evolution yeah and it's um man why can't i it's um he basically just has like he turns into a giant bodybuilder with like nuts for arms and hands. This engine bad. sucks. Wonder if it's the engine we have that's wrong. We're cooking. We got plenty of fuel. I just don't know that we're going to make it. Zach built a CNC router for wood. Basically a 2.5D printer for wood. Ooh. Yes, Zach, we know what a CNC router is. That's nice. Our mom says Meltan gets swole. Man, that's having a. I hope that's not a drug really reference. Nice. I think this may actually make it because you're only 25 percent of the way through your fuel. Maybe we're going really slow. Oh no. Oh come on, RCS, please. <laughs> oh no. Please went out. No. Bye bye. Oh, I think oh I no. need to put more on. Oh yeah, that, that's it right there. That's the orientation we want. Oh, that oh that's so cool. cool. <laughs> I put all your stuff in one stage. <laughs> you could have at least deployed the landing gear. What am I controlling? Don't know. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's your it's your hatch. <laughs> okay, let's revert to vehicle assembly. Um, let's let's find a, a an engine that has max thrust because I wonder if that engine just doesn't have max thrust. Um, can I search by thrust? 
No, but if you if you like right click while you're hovering over them, it'll show you that thrust ASL, which is the atmospheric thrust yeah. vector. So that's 250. Let's look down at these puppies. Yeah, let's sort by size again. Nice. So that is 1205. What's the one we're on right now? 37, 40. Maybe that is. I think it's this. Yeah. Too much fuel. So what if we... What? Oh, I guess we can sort this No, I went the wrong way. You already had it sorted by size. You just oh, did reversed I? it and looked in the wrong direction. <laughs> I stupid. There we go. Oh, that's what you had. Oh no, you you didn't. No, have. I had that. Yeah. So what if we do asparagus staging of this size? That's a big bloody engine. What's the thrust on this puppy? Thirteen of three. That's not bad. Okay, so asparagus staging on this guy. Yeah. So what, you want right. eight? Well, but no, let's do three and three. Okay. Three and three. Yeah, that looks good. Now, do you want to do fuel or boosters? Let's try boosters. Well, no, if we're going to do asparagus staging, we should. It, it has to be. Oh, yeah, because they fuel into each other, right? Yeah. So, let's go. And we could probably just do, like, the original size you had. Which is this? So I forget what that's called, like, Mark 1. Yeah, that looks good. Oh, yeah. Okay. What do you think? Yeah. Okay, so now let's do the... Ooh. I don't think that's going to be stable, though. No, I don't think so either. Yeah, so let's do fuel lines and, and engines and see how it goes. I'll do fuel lines first. So I want it to feed into the center, right? No, so you want... Basically view this as three stages, right? So one stage is three rockets, and they feed into the next stage, which is the other three rockets. And they feed into the last stage, which is the center rocket. So that way you're going to launch, drop three rockets, drop the next three rockets, drop the center rocket. So I want the so center one fires. Yeah, they all fire at the same time. But you have, I have to find them. three oh, separate no, sorry, stages. No, uh... Yeah, in terms of you drop three external, then you drop the other three external, and then you drop yes. the center. So these fuel lines... So yeah, let me feed... let me put the rocket on first. Should I do the swivel, the normal swivel, or no? Um, I would just do it by the best um, ASL thrust value. But those are size. some of those are yeah. So what size is this? Um, I'm not sure. So that that's the, that's the thing they don't make easier in here is like looking at something's size. Yeah, I always feel like it's like a a look. Like you I just don't. A, yeah, I don't understand how they still have like simple. So it says one meter. Maybe for that's what? it. See next to the picture, it says one meter. Oh, right there. Maybe. Eh, let's just try it out. Um. So, so ASL two hundred five. Yeah, because that's the atmospheric thrust value. Um. Two hundred eight. But I think oh, those the one meter big. doesn't mean anything. So that one fits. 108. What's this one? That's or 208. Solid. Sorry. Is our highest one so far. Yeah, so let's, so let's do, do this do guy. guy. Yeah. Which doesn't snap. That's disconcerting. Is that not a liquid? No, it is. Well, uh, right click it. Let's see what it oh, does. Oh, there. It snapped. Okay. What? Doesn't want to snap. This this game, man. Sometimes. This game just has like basic like user experience and bugs. And it just feels like they never actually fixed them. 
Like, that's not, clearly, that's not going to work. But it, yeah, it's just that it's weird because it should. You know what I'm going to do? Perfect. Yeah. Okay. So, that fires, that fires. Yeah, so you're going to have all seven that rockets fires. fire at once. So and then the, the group... next stage is... The next stage... So the first stage is fire all seven rockets. The next stage is drop three rockets. Yeah. There you go. And then those feed it. And then the next one's so, feed it. So wait, let dinner. me make sure I get those right. So that's those ones, which is that. Yes. So those drop... Yeah. And then this one. Yeah. So once that one finishes. Those, more those drop, but what's, what's, I think you have too much in three. Yeah, the, the top's too tough in three shouldn't be in there. So that goes, then that'll go. And, and then you, good. yeah, and then you get rid of the big rocket. Gotcha. Okay, let me just throw. I think we're looking good. I always forget where it is. No, I thought it was in structural. A little, uh, oh, I'm sorting by size, that's why. Oh, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Should we let's, try it? Uh, yeah, let's save it first. Save. Launch. Let's do it! Wait, there's different launch sites you can choose from? Yeah, I wonder if that's a good idea. Oh, I forgot about the top! <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoops. Okay, you ready? Yes. Oh, I forgot that. But the you gotta do max thrust. You think? Oh yeah, definitely for launch. Beautiful. Holy moly! Beautiful. We may make it. I think it's just a question of if we have enough fuel. Okay, get ready. This, I think, this is. I'm not saying this is it. This is very close. This looks good. This is pretty good so far. Oh, and we're still gaining speed. You can probably start tipping over. No, no, no. Oh. Oh. This looks good. This looks really good. I'm gonna bring her down a little bit. Ian, this might be it, boy. Oh my god, that's orbit right there. Yeah, we gotta. And we've still got almost half our fuel left. And we still have that stage for getting to moon orbit. Uh oh, you're a little lopsided. I know. I can fix it, though. <gasps> Whoa! What's that? Oh my goodness. It's a little far. Okay, this is not going to be good. You know what we need to eh, do? We could just not burn as long as it says. Oh yeah, this looks good. Oh no. Oh, it, it's stable. I was worried when it tipped over, it was just going to leave. So it says we need to burn for four minutes. I think we have enough fuel. Then again, you have a huge orbit set. So we don't need to burn that long. So the problem is it's, it's messing with it. Oh, it's because we didn't launch uh, good enough. Uh, I didn't turn fast enough when we first launched. Yeah, I, th I think we'll be okay, though. Let's just see how far this gets us.
Yeah, yeah so I, I think I got to turn sooner, but... I did not expect this to work this way. God bless Asparagus staging. Oh, you were tipping down, by the way. Yeah, but it's... See, that's why your orbit's going to be wonky. Yeah, you got to pull up. You got to get level with the horizon. So this is the stage that we'll use to get to the moon. Although, if we do the launch better, then we'll have more fuel. Yeah. You want to just right. redo launch? Yeah. This looks good. Oops, that's the wrong way. This looks real good. Okay, so the one thing I'm going to do quick... I think those will work from there. Actually, Do you want to add point. more than just one? Oh, sorry. I'm an idiot. Yeah. Yeah, those will work from there. Uh, but I know they need monopropellant. And I don't know if it gets transferred that whole way. I forget. There, I think there's some way to like look at fuel flow, but yeah, that's good enough. Okay. Colton, you missed our very, very successful... Karen's here. Hi, nice baby. Baby, uh, my mom sent me Halloween decorations. I'm very excited. I showed them to you. Um, right. Okay. So, yeah, max it out. We launch it. We got to figure out where the turn is. Babu. Oh, you got to max that thrust, baby. Oh, sorry. Yeah. So beautiful. Uber, you gotta kick your rockets. Thank you. <laughs> I was I was paying attention to moving. Oops! Oh, you kicked those way too early. <laughs> <laughs> I I went and saw um first man last night and it was really good but the whole time I couldn't stop thinking about uh, Kerbal Space Program <laughs> and we're just mid-flight again nothing happened nothing happened nothing at all Done did it again, Ian. I usually wait until seven, seven thousand, I think, to start the turn and burn. Let me look it up. That's true. I might be doing a suborbital thing. Okay. Set thrust by eighty max Z. Go up. You go straight up until the vehicle speed is 100 meters per second. When, yeah, we'll it's reaches, when it reaches 100 meters per second, pitch it 10 degrees to the east. Man, it oh. just goes. Yeah, you know what? We may need RCS on the payload up top. Oh, I think you're right. Because it's probably top heavy. Okay, so you, once you Wait, hit 100 meters be, per second, why would tilt it to 10 degrees. Oh, I don't know if I can put... I can't. Oh. You know what? We're going to have to deal with it. What if you just put fins on the bottom? Oh, you're right. I didn't have fins. I forgot to put more fins on it. Okay, so I think it's launch 100 meters per second and then 10 degrees to the east. And then just follow the prograde. Oh no. Oh, okay. That looks pretty good. Yeah. 
I'd say keep tilting it slightly. Okay, and then now I think we want to gradually tilt over, right? Actually, let's check our apoapsis, because we may want to kill the engine. Ooh, not yet. This is pretty cool. We're doing it, everybody. It is a thick payload, Karen. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'd say kill the engine. God, that's beautiful. I always loved when it started playing that spacey music. Mm hmm. Oh, oh, no, cancel. How do I stop a warp? I think it's T. Or, sh or slash. Slash. Yeah. We're good. That's the other thing is. I feel like every time I want to do a maneuver or mess with the, the the flight path, I have to click five times to get to actually what I want to click on because it's it's you always just click in the wrong way. Yeah. Oh, boy. OK. Oh, yeah, we're looking real good. Hey, aren't you burning way too early? You're supposed to do it halfway. Halfway to it? Half, half. So half of the burn time is on either side of zero. Oh, okay. So I think this is going to be the next difficult part is seeing if this stage can actually put us in moon orbit. Oh, we can't even get into Earth orbit. Yeah, I think it's that beginning angle. Maybe. No, I don't think it's gonna happen. I think we got to get that uh, initial angle right. Yeah, but what if we just get more fuel or better or more boost on the engines? That way our margin isn't so slim. Because I'm not sure that that stage alone, that small stage alone is gonna get us to moon orbit. I mean, it will because we'll be in space. Yeah, but it, it's like it's barely pushing right now. You know what I mean? Yeah, I think we're just to... Uh, here, let me revert to our vehicle assembly. Yeah. Um, Zach, if you're on Discord, let me know. Unless you're in bed again, then don't let me know. Because that's gross. Um, okay, Delta Wing. Yeah. What do you think about that? Oh, wait, that's three. Oh. Um. Nope. So... What if we just make that middle stage bigger? Make it thicker. This middle stage? Yeah. That way we would we would get more fuel and we wouldn't have to um, rely on the adapter. True. 
and I don't even think we put another rocket in there. Maybe we just make it one big, huge fuel tank. Really? You think? Yeah, we can try that. Okay, let me set this up to the side. Uh, here, I just want to reach out to a technical expert here uh, to see if uh, anyone could could help us here. I run out of stories, so. Uh, so I think our expert's on the line. I'm not quite sure. Mm -hmm. um, How can I help them anyway? Oh my gosh, our expert here, expert uh, O.J. Simpson witness here, um, Zach Crosby, oh. uh, no relation, um, but he's here and he's ready to help. Zach, how are, you, how are you doing today? Well, I'm good, and I made sure the glove did not fit. Oh, that's key. <laughs> that is key. Uh, could not have quit. Could not. Would not. Will not. Okay, so we don't need any of this, but... I'm um, sorry, Zach, to drag you into this. I was just... I know I said last time I'd bring you on. So yeah, it's unbelievable. I'm doing it this time. Wait, where is the... Where'd the rover go? Oh. Oh, it's right there. You know, I'm going to be a bad boy. Do it. Wait, okay. You don't need a command module, right? No, I know I don't. Yeah, because you just have the one Kerbal and the rover. What's the big one? Is it this one? Yeah. Exactly what I want. Oh, it looks so good. It's so big. So, I just need... Um, so, Zach, yeah. what have you been up to? Talk to the folks. Uh, well, uh, as I was telling uh, Ian, I built that CNC router machine. Nice. And uh, I just bought a uh, dust collector, which does not work in my garage because it pulls too many amps. So now uh, I gotta run more wire. I I need to get one of them from my shop I share with my dad because I did some uh, I did like a two by four table where you glue all the two by fours together, and then you route the top with a router sled. And it oh makes yeah, like a yeah. Cheap, like a cheap butcher's block type table. And that mm -hmm. shop was just covered in sawdust by the end of it. Yeah, I, I was cutting foam. I was making like a topographic map of a, a southern Utah and this pink foam. And then I came in the next morning and it was just everywhere. Oh. In my my garage, which is probably like 400 square feet, everything was covered in dust. Oh, geez. That stinks. Yeah, it wasn't fun. So that's what I've been doing. That and work. And uh, Nice. Yeah. Good to, it's good to hear from you. This may work. Yeah, maybe. I think this might work actually. The um, only Zach, question... you can see the non-stream stream now uh, on yeah. Discord. This is this is weird. I'm I actually have the uh, the actual stream up, and the delay is is oh, is weird. Yeah. I mean, yeah. it's just um, Ian is incredibly racist. I don't even want to bring it up right now because he might go on a tangent. But I'm just so like, racist that I, I asked that we add a delay to the stream so that I could insert racist things. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's not it's not to wow. in case he says something yeah. racist, I'm not gonna cut out, it's to give him a platform. <laughs> <laughs> Did you say it's to give him a platform? Yeah. And the, we were, the, we were, delay, the delay is to, to get the press involved. It's like quickly you <laughs> type on Twitter we see it now all... in ten seconds. Wow, this looks so much better oh. now. <laughs> I know, but it looks like less of an adult toy, or as they called it in the seventies, a marital aid. Marital? God. What is? What did it? Oh, love oils. Love oil. <laughs> this place in uh, Utah said love oils. This is a love oil applicator. Well, in Utah, I, you're not allowed to talk about sex, so it, you have to call it certain things, hey, like the beast love oils? with two bags. A beast with two <laughs> bags. I had oh. a professor in college who at that and we found out it was like a Victorian England term the beast with two backs so That's good so disgusting but it's also kind of stifling because it kind of limits what you can do if you're doing the beast with two backs you yeah know? you can't have a third back you're not the beast with touching fronts you know <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
That's that was so a, good. <laughs> beast with touching fronts. <laughs> That's just because then if you think of it as like an actual monster and not a sexual phrase, it's just a very weird looking monster. <laughs> Um, Zach is older, by the way, Mom. Colton, oh, you should know boy. that. Yeah, older, more attractive, more successful. Wow. Oh my God, this may actually work. Wait, is the fuel coming out of this? Yeah. Well, not yet. It's it's because it's all coming out of the external tanks. Yeah, so th this was kind of the gamble, is if adding that extra fuel tank is going to actually lessen the range because we're adding so much weight. I think it might be better. Okay, it is taking from there. Oh, Colton, the comedy is just getting worse. Pretty much. Yeah. Oh, boy. I'm on push to talk, so I don't say anything. I have to say it and then think about it, then remember I'm on push to talk. That's the worst. It it's it's helpful. Well, if if my dog comes in here, then it'll be really helpful to not have uh, noise. Is your dog racist too? <laughs> Incredibly so. He See, every is, time he, he barks, unbelievable. Every time he barks, it sounds like the N word, and it's just no, very Ian. it's very <laughs> inconvenient. <laughs> that'd be oh, that'd be a great That's terrible. Speaking of of weird racist terms, uh, I'm not gonna say any. But uh, <laughs> when I went by my desk collector, <laughs> this this old guy kept talking about how his brother-in-law is 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 half Native American. He used mm -hmm. different terms entirely, and how that was the worst thing ever. And I was just sitting there like, I don't, I don't even know the first thing about why you have this terrible opinion about Native Americans. Yeah, I loved I cowboy movies as a child. Yeah, like even like how old this guy is, it's like it doesn't matter how old you are, you don't have a you're not old enough to have a valid reason to hate Native Americans. <laughs> I know. Right, yeah, the, he, he was he did look like he was from the 1800s. So, oh, okay. We, we could have something there. But... How are we doing on fuel by the way? You tell me. Not great. Oh. <laughs> no, that's pretty good because we're still on the main stage. There's no second stage, Ian. Oh, that's right. But well, we do but have your ship. But that's still a lot of fuel. I'm feeling pretty good. Yeah, I'm this is this is good. Oh, I love this music. Yes. It's the you entered space music. Hmm. Okay. So this this is probably not gonna work. So what's what's yeah, the we're next step? We're keeping is on it, the horizon. Is it adding a second stage of asparagus staging, but on the top of the rocket? Looks, this looks. This almost looks professional. And and getting rid of the the payload fairing may have helped shed some weight. Oh, that's true. All I know is when I watch SpaceX things, as soon as they're in space, they deploy the fairing. Yeah. Gentlemen. Oh, are we in orbit? We have achieved orbit. Wait, are you sure? What's our par parallax? Huzzah! I mean, it's 24,000, have... so we're going to crash we... into the <laughs> ground. Yeah, we have not achieved orbit. <laughs> Yeah, so I wonder if we set up a second. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, boy. I want to control from you, there, please. You've lost it. No. It's gone. <laughs> bye bye. Goodbye. Um, Crap. Yes, I wonder if we add a second asparagus staging up top. Please. <laughs> I did. So I found this out when I was testing. There's like this whole like cheat debug menu you can bring up. <laughs> What? <laughs> that was incredible. Oh, now I'm controlling it. I just had to hit it really hard. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, can we just explode the rest of it? Oh, should we try and bring it down? So, oh, I can't control. Wait. 
Yeah, your your stagings are all messed up. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Well, I pulled this out a little bit. Oh, we're in a stable orbit now. Wait, is that eighty six thousand? Yeah. My God. That's bonkers. Oh, wait, no, why am I controlling from this? I don't know. Kerbal's wonky. No, that's not what I want. Can you switch? I don't think so. Oh, I did. Okay. Whew. Nice. Yep, I got my little butt protector on. I love it. We're, we got this little guy into orbit. I uh, know. The problem is, I don't think we can uh... go anywhere. But well, where? Oh no, no, you can't. We can get back. We can land it. Oh, so look you at can... perfectly crossed orbits. You can use the mono propellant thrusters to land it to slow down enough. That's how I was doing. Oh it. yeah, I'll. Uh, I could do that here, maybe. Yeah. The only thing is, you have to orient it weird because they're point. They're technically pointed down instead of retrograde so you have to like orient the ship in a weird um, direction it will it will know the maneuver for the engines oh it will yeah cool so let's warp to next maneuver let's land the sucker we i don't think we have enough thrust though no, we should have a bunch of mono propellant. Because I was able to land. You can go ahead and um, deploy those. That'll get rid of the landing gear. That's okay. Um. Okay, how are we looking? Are we facing? Yeah, see, we're not facing the right direction. You're not facing the right direction. Is this? Are these activated? Oh, they're not. That's why. Yeah. Now, now they are. Okay. So you gotta you gotta point the thrusters retrograde. Yeah, yeah but you see the problem is, no, no. But, oh, the, but the thrusters are facing. Yeah. So you have to manually. I think it's, yeah, it's that light blue. Because you basically point it radial in. Yeah. And then this, this should be plenty to kill the orbit. And then, and then I, I was firing them on. Yeah, we're, um, uh, actually, wait. I, get rid of I was firing them on descent to slow down. And then the parachute would Yeah, 23,000. <clears throat> Oh, yeah, wait, but once we get close to the atmosphere, you need to orient your ass end. Retrograde. Yeah. Otherwise, everything will burn up, and you'll explode. Nice. Here we go. Man, we're landing all the way back already? I know. Crazy. What a journey. So, Colton, I we, we were originally saying no survivors, but then I started building this rover, and I had the crazy idea of once it lands on the moon, I then deploy lo enormous landing gear to tilt it up towards the sky and then take off again like another rocket. So it's basically a rocket, a mini rocket inside of a bigger rocket. And it actually kind of works. <laughs> oh, yeah, here comes the heat. So here this comes the should pain. survive. Should is a word I don't want to hear. It it won't. Is that the word you were looking for? Very close. Rip yeah. it oh, up. No. <laughs> <laughs> My spoiler. <laughs> I wonder if there's a way to lock the rotation. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I did just notice, though, that some of my tires are busted. Man, it is... It's a good angle. 
Ha, ha. Don't, don't you do it. <laughs> well, Ian, what are you doing? I can, I can see that cursor. Oh. <laughs> I'm not going to do anything. Man, Ian, uh, I'm just going to say this. You did a great job. Uh, I did spend about 10 hours building it, so <laughs> over several days. And about 75% of that time was staged around the stupid of idea of if I put giant landing gear on it, then it will stand itself upright. <laughs> <laughs> I went through so many rockets. I went through so many rockets just getting to the, just getting to orbit. Oh, yeah. And then I was like, yeah. I got to put a stupid vehicle on this. I got to put an enormous, like, 100 meter long vehicle. <laughs> that has four rocket stages for some reason. <laughs> oh, so frustrating. Yeah. Um, Zach, how's, uh, how's that um, space game you've been playing? Oh, man. Uh, the one that you texted me saying you don't have time for me. I Listen, I'll get there. I know. So I've been playing Star Citizen because uh, the oh. 3.3 just came out. And I've got an Aurora, a little baby thing, and I'm having so much fun just oh, quantum good. traveling over to places. And uh, I did a mission where I popped out, had to EDA, and get a bunch of cargo back into my tiny little ship. And and that's why that's when I texted you, Will, and was like, we need to play this game, or you need <laughs> to do some sort of uh, live stream of it, because it was just so much fun. We really should, because I, I thought Star Citizen was still in just like weird weekend alpha so i didn't even know it was at like a decent playable stage yet yeah the frame rates have finally come back to reality from like two frames per second on my system now i'm up at what is happening to I the was landing, the landing, gear. landing gear. <laughs> did you deploy the <laughs> landing gear <laughs> i wasn't sure if i do anything oh no i just i was looking at the other the the delay and and not noticing so it was, <laughs> uh, it was incredible <laughs> But yeah, we should definitely play Star Citizen. Yeah, and and I'm I'm always around. I can uh, be that that random guy in the background that that can help you. Nice. Colton's loving this, by the way. Yeah. Kerbal is like exciting, maybe ten percent of the time, and then the other ninety percent is just. It's a lot of anticipation. Yeah. With very little release. And they they really should have a quick rewind function. So that you don't spend 15 minutes redoing like an orbital launch procedure just to get to the point where you keep failing. Yeah, it's, it's frustrating. Man, we're uh, looking good here. Yep. Okay. So that's coming down. And then I, and then you should be able to orient and fire the mono propellant just to slow yourself down more if you want to, but you don't have to. And then I can't remember if the parachutes auto fire or not. I feel like they don't. Let's test it. Oh no. They should auto fire. Oh no. Oh, you know what? <laughs> I didn't switch to the staging for them. <laughs> I think, I think the for me, the best part was that I hadn't touched my mouse in 20 minutes, so my entire, all my monitors went to sleep, and all I heard was just a crash. <laughs> um, oh, man. I don't know. So it went well? Did it we went land? great. We landed fine. <laughs> oh, so, all right, um, so I think let's, before we call it, let's try getting enough fuel in orbit that we feel comfortable. Right. We can get to moon orbit tonight, right? What time is it? only 11 15 what do you think i don't know i i think if we duplicate let's try duplicating that asparagus staging up top really well, you have 45 minutes until red dead goes live. <laughs> yes. but they're just gonna well let's try it it could blow them up but it could also not because we could always jettison the bottom ones first right maybe or no they would all jettison at the same time i think and yeah, we can try it i mean this isn't we the just worst try like thing this. i've ever done oh, 
those are on fours. Why is it? I hate that it clicks over to four. Oh, it's because the fins are there. Yeah, but that's okay. When did these ones fire? That's but actually, this may work better because then they're not they're not directly above another one. Oh, those all launch. They're staggered. So I need to feed these what into the main fuel tanks? Uh, no, I I I would asparagus feed them as well. Oops. So it's two uh, and uh, two. Uh, uh. Stop. Oh, it's back to four. No, I'll just do one. This one. And. Fuel. Okay, looking good. This one. So those. Oh, that so didn't I need take to it. separate those two out, right? That uh, fuel line didn't take. Yeah. And Colton, I don't think Will will play Red Dead 2 on a live stream. He needs uh, first couple hours by himself so we can uh, get used to surroundings. Usually we put him in some nice warm water so we get used to it. <laughs> the worst. Uh, eventually, we're planning on doing a live stream, not necessarily with a single player, but once Red Dead Online comes out. Yeah. Depending on that launch date, we may end up doing a single player stream in a couple weeks if the online is a month away. Yeah, because they still haven't announced that date yet. <clears throat> Just like PC, when it's coming out for PC. Yep. Yep. I'm only crying a little bit about it. <laughs> Man, you just gotta buy one of those crappy consoles for it. I'm debating talking to my brother-in-law and being like, can I just borrow it, borrow his <laughs> Xbox for, you know, a month or two? Well, the, the 1S is down to like 200 all the time now. Yeah, but did you see the, they were just doing comparisons I of did. the uh, processing. Yeah. And yeah. oof, the new, so the I, new, the best Xbox is the best. Yeah, so I have, I have a normal Xbox One. Yeah, same. And I'm going to play it. And if it's bad, I am going to take that Xbox One to GameStop and do the $200 trade in and walk out with an Xbox One X for 300 bucks. Yeah, I've been planning on getting an Xbox One X, so this might... Although, so yeah. I put Red Dead onto... It's on an external, so at least it'll load it quickly. Yeah. Okay, so wait. These ones will be gone first. Yes. Which is... But yeah, that... What was the resolution? Wasn't it like 964 or 984? Was the resolution on the normal Xbox for Red Dead 2? Oh, yeah, I didn't even... I didn't even see... I yeah. just I was just looking at the four pictures next to each other and like oh I, yeah. I couldn't do that because it's it's not hitting 1080, it's it's upscale. Oh, is that why? Oh yeah, yeah, that's stuff fun. Yeah, I uh, I bought a, a dust collector for 200 bucks instead of uh, Xbox. So <laughs> yeah, my money. Wait, where's these ones? Those oh, no, three? Col Colton says it's not perfectly symmetrical. You're not perfectly symmetrical. The C C me try. You don't know how to spell Colton. Just kidding. Sy symmetry. Where's... I don't know how to spell symmetry. Now that I think about it. <laughs> Where are these? Oh, those three. So these three yeah. should fire. S so you should. You should be able to these put. Two. Those three should fire with those three. Okay, that's right. Who cares? Let's do it. This is going to be very risky. You're risky. Full throttle, baby. Thank you. <laughs> it's like, what's happening? Why is it going so slow? Do you know about Z and X? Oh, those are blood. Yes, I do know about the next. Yeah. I'm just so used to using the other ones. Oh, yeah. Okay, now. Ditch. That looks correct, right? Oh, no. Oh, okay. Don't worry, I got it. Oh, I thought it, 
kind of just doing that on its own. Man, those engines oh below do not enjoy that. I know, I know, but I think they're almost done. Oh, that was close. How are we feeling? All of them explode. <laughs> oh. I'm feeling I'm feeling better. Yeah, a little bit better maybe. Shouldn't we be at full throttle? What's no, our apple you don't want to accelerate too fast. So I don't want to just blow it out of the water if we're going super fast. Yeah. Looks pretty good. Are you feeling better, Will? Yeah, I'm feeling better. This one? I I still just love the look of it so much. I like that it thinks it's a plane. Yeah. Fifty nine, hundred fifty nine, sixty four. So far. Yeah, can you do the other maneuver? Flatten it out, even it out. I'll do that secondary. I just want to get this one done first. It's about 25 second delay. Testing, testing. Hello, everyone. Can you hear me? Are we back up? Hello everyone, can you hear me? Okay, I think we are back up. Um, I'm pretty sure Colton, you're probably the only person watching, but uh, Will's power just went out. So we're gonna have to call it here for tonight. Uh, I think we're probably gonna keep doing this on a weekly basis. It's a lot of fun, um, but thanks for watching. Bye, Mom. Thanks for joining, Bye. Zach. Bye, Mom. Yeah, of course. I love being here. Bye, Will, wherever you are, and we'll never see you again. It was, it was nice knowing you, Will. Bye-bye. <laughs> Everything in this universe has a beginning. The Big Bang. The formation of nebular matter into stars and planets. The first collections of amino acids in the Earth's oceans. The first creatures to leave them. The first mammals. The first primates that walked upright. The first religion. The first printing press. Are you guys still there? And ultimately, the first synthesizer. Robert A. Moe.